Right, everyone, my collector here. Right, I've had to change the uh, way this is done now, so hopefully you can hear me all right and all that. Um, you'll have to let me know about the fan. But, yeah, I've had to change it, so no slow mode. All right, Ping. Slightly easier that I can see people as they come on, though. All right, Liam. So, yeah, if you ever wanted to support this channel, I say this now because it's the best time for me to do it. So, if you ever wanted to support me, there's various ways. So, there's Patreon which uh, Liam does. So you get your name on here, uh, you get your channel a bit of advertisement. <clears throat> uh, for one, you do it for $1 a month or ATP a month. And, oh, by the way, I'll tell you something about the Patreon later because um, I bought some stuff last night with the Patreon funds, stuff I've been talking about. Um, there's also affiliate links if you ever want to use those. So the affiliate links are eBay, Amazon, and Gearbest. Shop at those websites, and I'll get a percentage of what you spend at no extra cost to you. Um, there's merchandise. And then there's um, PayPal donations if you want to do that. So, all right, Mitch, Len, Krylon, and Tim. You all right? I'm using the new uh, way to stream, which means I probably won't be able to do slow mode. We'll see how it goes. All right, Tim. I said Tim, didn't I? Yeah. This is it's slightly better in a way. Like, pop-out chat straight away on pop-out chat. It's already on live chat. I can see how many likes there are, how many people there are on, how long I've been on for. But no slow mode. Um, all right, Rich. All right, Peach. So, yeah, I'll just get sort of settling because it's a bit weird at the minute. I feel like I've done, like I'm missing something. Yeah, participants, pop out chats, toggle timestamps. Yeah, it looks like no, um, no slow mode unless people wanted to look. What's that? So, does the mic sound the same as normal? But I had to select the right microphone today as well. Yeah, yeah, not quite that long yet. Len, <laughs> a little bit long. What is that, about four mil? <laughs> Bing said, sounds all right, other than slow mode being missing. Hopefully everyone is a bit slow at typing. Yeah, hopefully. You know, I know some people quite like it um, about the slow mode, but um, it's hard for me to read everything if, you know, without it. Do you know what I mean? Marcus, you right, mate? Weapons officer, sounds fine to me. Yeah, wrong mic on the YouTube stream earlier. Yeah, it's it's... It's easy to do, isn't it? I'll tell you what mine tries to do. It tries to pick the microphone for that camera, which is absolutely shite. Um, tries to pick one for the computer, and then I've got to select that. So, yeah, luckily I noticed. <clears throat> yeah, so shooting competition started today if, for people who want to join that. And anyone can join it, meaning, you know, Americans can join with their firearms if they want. We all know that Electro used to join in with his cannon. So, yeah. I'll tell you some of the stuff. When there's more people on, I'll start telling you some of the stuff that I've, I've written down. What I bought with the Patreon money recently. Um, oh, yes. Nice one being it. I'll write that down. Cheers, mate. Thank you. I thought I'd forgotten something. Cheers, Bing. Yeah, I'll do that. Bing said, don't forget to mention about Twitch, Mike. Uh, people are missing out on good conversation. Exactly, mate. They are. Especially the ones who was on all that week. <laughs> you know, they can get the same exact thing, but on Twitch. <clears throat> right, while there's not a load of people on, I'm just going to see if I can... I'm going to see if, if this video comes up on my video list. I may be able to edit it in there. No, I can't. It didn't come up. I was hoping it would come up. Um, right, if I go to my channel... It should be on there, shouldn't it? But I might be able to get the slow mode on in a bit of a roundabout way by going to the video. Yeah, here it is. Going on here, now doing edit. Yeah, it's a bit of a fucking rigmarole, but I'll be able to get the slow mode on this way. I can edit now, but you won't be able to see none of this. All right, Rich. Um, Bing said, don't even have to watch or watch the, all the gameplay, just spend time chatting. We all get lost in conversation, and after half an hour, we end up going on about the next quest. That's it. Yeah, the game is just, 
the game is just sort of something for me to do. It sort of um, don't even come into it really. You know what I mean? No, I can't do the slow mode. It don't matter. I was going to see if I could. Ah oh, well, it's it's something that won't be there until I I'll have to keep doing the feedback saying put slow mode on. But yeah, don't forget the like everyone. There's thirteen people watching. Seven likes. So who else we got on? Yeah, Red Bings, didn't I? Um, Pete said Prime Amazon. The boys is fucking amazing. Right, I'll check that out soon. <coughs> like I said, don't try too hard, Mike. <laughs> no, luckily I couldn't get it. I'll have to look that up though. Don't say boo, right, mate? Mitch said great videos on the Horizon Red Back Pistol Crossbow. Just bought one. A nice one, Mitch. I tell you what. You'll be very happy with that. I tell you, I love mine. Here's mine up here. Best fucking crossbow I ever bought. And I do quivers for these if you ever wanted. One £12.50 for a quiver that connects onto the um, weaver rail with a proper mount. Holds six bolts, any bolts. So you can uh, add a bit of an extra element to your um, crossbow that way. I ain't got one. I, I, funny, I keep selling all of them, so I don't even have one myself. <clears throat> yeah, they're well worth having, they are. Shamrock Survival, you right, mate? Mark has said, what is that again, Mike? What, the quivers? <laughs> £12.50. I'd say link in the description, but then email me. If that's what you meant. <clears throat> so yeah, when there's a when there's some more on, if it gets to up to twenty, I will uh I'll tell you the stuff that I've written down. I noticed a couple of I did some things today, some interesting things. Um spent some of the Patreon money on something. Oh no, the crossbow. This is the horizon red back, this one, Marcus. I thought you was uh, getting me to say my uh <laughs> stuff again this is the red back horizon yeah I thought, but definitely the best pistol crossbow i've ever owned yeah they're fucking brilliant it's what if you look up what mitch wrote there, it's the horizon red back pistol crossbow pink said back um what did you just say i think you start it as well <clears throat> i don't know if you're not winding me up now Bing said, just waiting for JBO, Nell, and Iron Man Spartan, and it's sorted, yeah. That's it. <clears throat> well, I'm already coughing already. Yeah, well, there's Nell. What's the delay like on here at the minute? Because I'm seeing like myself instantly today. I'm not seeing the, the, what you see, you know what I mean? Patriotic Brit, right, mate? Richard said, started building a new forge, got the table done, just the hood and the legs, and it's done. I was wondering, you've been hard at it lately, haven't you? Been making anything to sell? Things that warrior, you, you're right now. You're right. Being said, where did you buy it and how much? Um, if you did say, I missed it. I bought mine from uh Merlin Artery, I think it was about 50 quid. They're well worth 50 quid, I tell you. There's no delay today, it must be better on earlier. Weapons and stuff said, hold a finger up and ask us when we see it. All right. Um, all right, let me think how to do this. Yeah, all right. So, yeah. All right, tell me when you see that. That Yeah, that's like two seconds then. That's probably decent, that is. That, yeah, that was like two seconds. That's all right, isn't it? Zed, you all right, mate? <laughs> that's a good, that's a good, um, that's a nice short delay, that, isn't it? That's definitely better on here then. Then I said the quiver is uh, superb on the red back, Mike. Cheers, Len. But I'll, I'll be honest, I was very happy with that crate, you know, them, them quivers. Uh, yeah, they came out really good, even though I do say so myself. But no, I was very happy with them. That's one of the best things I've made. And really, really fucking, they're like really nice to make, but they're not, they're not hard work. And you know what I mean? Peter's seen it about 10 seconds later. <laughs> so is Pedro Brit. Uh, weapons I've said, very good people. Uh, very good people said there was barely any delay on my stream this afternoon. So they've improved it. Ah, nice. That's good, isn't it? 
Yeah, this is really this is really good, isn't it? I tell you, they've just got rid of the old way of doing um, live stream. They got rid of the Hangouts thing, so maybe it was something to do with the Hangouts. Because I can't do it that way anymore. This way is sort of, but this way is better in every way, apart from not being able to do the live um, chat. But funny thing is, at the minute, it seems all right. Yeah, got 18 on. Things up said, I'll submit my M48 Hellhawk crossbow for the competition. Nice one, mate. Yes, I'll look forward to that. Yeah, send me an email, Slingshot, and we'll sort that out. You know the bits to do, don't you? Um, yeah, I look forward to that. So that's that's used definitely confirmed. I know um I know Peach, Liam, Rich are definitely doing it. Uh Jade Schaefer has already emailed me saying he's gonna do it. Uh so now there's slingshot, electro, jumble shell boo has sent me a bit of his. Yeah, what's that? About seven already then. I'll I'll get these lot done once a week this time. Quite looking forward to it. <clears throat> Bing said, as long as there isn't any uh, boxing chats tonight, the chat will be fine. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, the, the boxing disagreement. Nels, had everyone been enjoying the sun today? I was actually out in the sun a bit today, Now I was, um, I fixed one of my air guns today. The old air gun that I trapped my hand in when I was about 10. Just there, got about seven stitches as a 10-year-old. Um, I fixed that today because I want to use it for the shooting competition for when... Anyone uses a lower powered air rifle, like Liam's going to use his um, Daisy. So I want to use a lower powered air rifle with open sights. Well, I managed to fix it today. I'll have a video on it tomorrow. So yeah, I managed to shoot that in the garden. When I first started shooting that today, it was so weak, it wouldn't even shoot the pellet out the barrel. Now I've got it so it will shoot through the bottom of a can. So you know, like the hard bit of a tin can, You're not a tin can, a can of beer. It will shoot through that now. So there'll be a video on tomorrow about that. Patriot Brit said, well, it's cooled down a bit now. Thank God. Yeah, saying that, it has cooled down, hasn't it? Marcus said to Nell, been in the garden all day long, umbrella on standby. <clears throat> yeah, pissed down the other day, didn't it? Um, Mitch said, big air gun fan. Yeah, nice one, mate. Yeah, I've got quite a few. I had them all out today. But yeah, fixed one. I'll show you it if you want. It's only a tiny little one. It's a little like five foot pound air rifle. It'll be good. <clears throat> It'll be good for certain things. Now I've had to bodge the trigger to stop make it safe. I'll talk about this in a second. I'll show you it properly in a second. Um, Peach said, "Did you say your revolver works, though?" I'm pretty sure it does, Peach. See that one just there, the one I'm pointing the barrel at. If that doesn't work, I have got another CO2 air pistol. So, yeah, if that don't work, the other one, I'm pretty sure one of them does. But anyway, so this I fixed today. I made a brand new bolt here, put a spring in, and it's shooting about five foot pound now. I have had to put an elastic band on the trigger, though, just to make sure it is really safe because this has got a faulty trigger. I'm going to have to catch up with his comments quickly. Uh, Marcus said to Patrick at Brit, where are you, mate? He lives in Colchester. Patrick said Brit, Brit so he lives in Braintree. Zed said, I had to go to the doctors today. Bloody hot um, work cycling there, I can tell you. Tom Zabu said, was having a look around Ellie today. Am I missing something there? No. What's that do? Yeah, Ellie today. I uh, couldn't find any weapon shops. I don't know if that was a joke, Zed. That one went straight out of my head if it was. <laughs> Petro Beer said, quite a small and unknown place. Oh, what brain tree? Richard said, not sold anything else at the moment, Mike. But I'm getting set up for quick production. I'm sticking to knives, rapiers, um, and sabres. Those scorpion bill hook heads are too expensive to make any profit on. It's a shame, isn't it? Some of them are just aren't worth. Some things aren't worth doing, are they, Rich? Too much time, too much cost in the materials. Patriot Brit says, between Colchester and Chelmsford. Marcus said to me, are they fixed sites? Yeah, well, sort of. Has got adjustable sites, but they're, um, the thread's gone in there, and you have to like, knock it with a hammer. But I've got them right. But yeah, sort of. They're sort of fixed now, <laughs> if that makes sense. So yeah, fix that. Pete says, should be on that. 
Should be cheap. Should be on that cheap one. Oh, what you're shooting, you mean? So, yeah. Um, I hope everyone's liking the stream, by the way. I can see exactly how many are today. 19 watching, 11 likes. Come on, get that up. Can I like it myself? <laughs> then said, oh, what was for dinner? Sorry, I saw you say that earlier, didn't you? Um, some kind of weird potato thing I thought would be good for survival rations. It was like a bag with ready-cooked potatoes, onions, and bacon in it that you fry, but it's all ready-cooked. That with a turkey breast and some Brussels sprouts. Marcus said, all air rifles used to have fixed sights at one time. Much better. I'll tell you what, Marcus, this one... This is at least from the 1960s or maybe 70s. Patriot Brit to Marcus. There's a place in Braintree called Turling. I suggest you look up the place. It's a really nice countryside and I love it. <coughs> Pete said, Are the sites fixed? Should be on a cheaper. Should be on the cheaper. Well, on on the revolvers, you mean? Um, they've both got adjustable open sights, if you know what I mean. Now you had noodles, did you? Oh, by the way, now, I managed to get uh, Iron Man Spartan on Twitch last night, by the way. His name is now um, R. Philop or something. <laughs> he couldn't do Iron Man Spartan. But, yeah, he was on. I've answered that, Pete. Can't you hear me? Yeah, it's got um, they're adjustable sights. But, yeah, that, that one doesn't move at all. And that one would move up and down, but I took the screw out. Dad said, I'm in a good mood tonight. I found out my Bowies that I thought I'd lost when I moved house. I put, oh, you found them? Oh, nice. That's good. A Paul Chen Californian Gold Rush Bowie. Oh, you found out it is? Tom Sabu said, air rifles have come a long way in the last 10 years or so. To be honest, I can't justify paying a grand for something that has the same power as something that costs 40 quid. Yeah, I would never go expensive on air rifles. I'd spend 200 quid on one, though. Fuck's sake. Come on, Pinks, you better start acting at them. You're confusing me now. <laughs> Bing said um, KP Hiff Off or something like that. Rachel Britt said to me, which country do you live in? It's nice. Oh, which county? Buckinghamshire, mate. Bobby Baldy said, greetings from the Netherlands. All right, mate. Greetings from England. Good to see you on. Zed said, no, I found it in the loft when I was looking for something else. That's good, though. That's good. Always good when you find things like that. Slingshot said, you have a great pistol. You have great pistol crossbow, Mike. Thank you. So do you now. Yeah. I can't wait to have a shooting competition with you, Slingshot. Little Blyer. You all right, mate? I said, finally able to swing by. Yeah, nice. Good to see you on. I can't do my slow mode tonight, so I'm going to be rushing like a bastard tonight. But um, Yeah, but it's, it's, it's not too bad at the moment. So... I, I spoke about the gun, so I fixed my gun. I um, The shooting competition started, so anyone wants to join in that, make sure you go and watch the video if you don't know what to do. Oh, yeah, sorry, Bing. I'm so fucking... Yeah. That's it. That's um, I'm Spark's name, isn't it, Bing? Sorry. Yeah, it meant that's his Twitter or something. Like that. That's it, Bing. Fuck's sake. I, I miss... You know, the, you know what I'm like. Go straight over my head. But yeah, when he comes on, we'll tell everyone. Bobby said, um, what are what are good USMC knife alternatives made and available in the EU, in your opinion? I'm not until sure. I've not bought any knives out for a long time, but maybe some of the viewers might be able to help you there. T2, you right, mate? Don't be Bruce said, Mike, I'll try and get close-up shots of the targets getting shot in a week or so. I hope the vid was okay. I think I'm going to suffer trying to sight in that rifle. Like, they're perfect rigs. Yeah, all you need to do, though, is just get the close-ups. Just do six shots in each for three rounds, and that's it. I've done. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah, that was good videos. 
that's exactly what I wanted. It's just you need the you need the um pellets going at targets as well. Uh, right, what was I saying? Shooting competition. Make sure you look join the shooting competition. Yeah, Jumbo's our boo is. He's already done half of his. I fixed that gun. Anyone notice that Jack Striker's uh, got an extra video available to watch on his channel now, and has also changed his uh, background picture to Jack Striker AI. So there. <laughs> Slingshot said Mike needs a girlfriend. <laughs> I'm perfectly happy being single, but yeah, girlfriend won't go on this. T2 said, Marcus, I'm officially old. Now, granddad, ah, oh, congratulations, mate. Dad said, um, Bobby, the John Noel Israel army knife would be a great option. Yeah, there you go, Bobby. That's a great choice. Yeah, I know which one that is, actually. Yeah, that's a decent one, isn't it, um, Zed? Yeah, British Army Survival Knife, again, very good option there. So I do a verbal intro too. Might have an issue doing the proposed target, so I'll be disqualified using the targets I already have because I don't have a printer. No, any targets are fine, Riggs. Do anything you want. Yeah, it says that in the video. If you watch the video, you'll see me say any or any or all right. Don't matter. No, anything. You, you could draw it on if you want. Harry Schmidt. Hello, darling. Um, Czech national. All right, mate. So you haven't been in one of these for ages. Bing said, yeah, and he has some videos that are still images with weird music. That's it. Oh, Bing, you had noticed, had you? Yeah, good news there for people. Then. I had the thing today about agreeing to the new um, the new terms today as well because I signed up to do to go on my blog. Colin said, Mike's lagging in the stream for me, and I'm trying to watch and text. <laughs> Patriot Brits are going to get a drink, BRB. Yeah, so, yeah, Jack has got a little bit of a change on his channel. So, yeah, make sure you check that out. That might be good news for all the Jack supporters. And I spent my Patreon money on the new board. It's easier there. <laughs> for the new board that's going there, I've ordered it last night. So, yeah. There'll be a new display behind me soon. It will go right up to there, right down to, you see the radiator there. So it'll be from there to there, as wide as that. And I don't know what I'll put on it yet. I've got plenty I can put on it, though. Things within a man needs the comfort of a woman sometimes, Mike. Uh, do you have to answer them for comfort? <laughs> if that's what they call it, yeah. <laughs> T2 said thank you, Mike, also. Yeah, congratulations, mate. Well, that's it, Bing. That's what I mean. Poor now. If they call it Amsterdam, then yeah, maybe. Number seven, Bill. I'll get some of your merch, mate. Hopefully mid-August. Now, ah, thank you, please. Irishman, you're right, mate. Czech National said, is there a Czech gun that uh, you just want? <laughs> Don't know. It, uh, see this Slavia made in Czechoslovakia? How's that for you? Just happen to have it. That is a genuine Czechoslovakian gun as well. Actually says there, made in Czechoslovakia. So I don't need one, mate. I've got my own Czechoslovakian gun right there. I fixed it today as well. That's a pure coincidence. I had that, by the way. <laughs> Mark said slingshot what you want tonight. <laughs> Zed said slingshot or I've got a story about a fellow I used to work with who went to Amsterdam. Bing said, at least you haven't. Don't have to worry about your knob changing colour. That's it. Bob said, uh, thanks for the suggestions, mate. We'll check them out. Yeah, I would recommend both of them knives, they said. Slingshot said, living alone can be lonely. It can. It definitely can. Harry said, you're locked in your house on a zombie apocalypse. What weapon do you pick up and why? My Warhammer. It's over there, definitely. Warhammer. Didn't you ask me this last time? Or was it someone else? Warhammer, because that will pierce a zombie skull very easily. It should come out easily enough as well. Jumbo Sabu, I wouldn't mind a VZ-58 Czech rifle. I was meant to lie, the shotgun made in Czechoslovakia, yeah? a prior. But yeah, there, there you go, Harry. That is made for... Uh, 
zombies skulls so yeah that i think but yeah Czech national yeah this this gun this is a slavia 624 look it up they'll fix that today that'll be in the shooting competition for when people use a lower powered air rifle how's a good choice where would you shelter in your area if you could not sure really there are quite a few places on a roof somewhere i suppose i don't know i refuse to say vz look at zed's name he says z, z not z so even if it is vz i ain't saying it <laughs> t2 said what's the best place you get throwing knives from in the uk not sure t2 i prefer to make mine bing said just need a celtic engraving so it looks like a steel war hammer from um yeah skyrim that's it cold steel t2 was saying uh pete was saying to t2 that's a pete how very dare you yeah they are. Zed said it richard said i remember mike you said that woman from one of the hellraiser movies looked pretty you that her skin on I hope there's no hellraiser themed porn in your browsing history <laughs> yeah fucking hell imagine i don't know what that would be like Entered Rambo knives up. Yeah, there it is. She's up. <laughs> Czech national said, "What a coincidence! I was given a Bavarian warhammer for my birthday. Um, those things might not be the best against zombies because of reach. Uh, that is a good point, I suppose. Yeah, not as much reach is there." Mitch said, "Has it got the power? Has it got much power? That rifle reminds me of the first ever rifle." bsa meteor um i'll tell you what it's smaller than a bsa meteor by quite a bit and it's probably only about five foot pound it's a proper junior air rifle i think the old bsa meters used to be eight or nine foot pound number so boo said i just tried to look up google um look up check gun shops to save time i put in check streets glad the kids in <laughs> in the room dangerous rn you're right mate he said you guys are able to buy tourniquets in the uk yes yeah if one thing i don't have in my um first aid kit is a proper tourniquet um i need to research those though because you need to use them properly don't you no blight said i know it's off topic but what do you think about the testing a ghetto flail at a power cord and a power um i would do that i'll have to see if i can make one yeah yeah, I don't, I, might, I don't mind trying that. Little black. Pete said, Rambo knife on the wall. This man is the devil himself. <laughs> Things up to every man wants to get laid. No man wants to beat off. <laughs> you are on a funny one tonight, ain't you, Slingshot? Mark said to me, I can see the logic in the comments delay, Mike. I can't keep up with this. <laughs> yeah, it's mad, isn't it? It is a bit, um, yeah, see you know what I mean? And now I have to I have to reply to things very quickly as well, which is a bit of a shame. Harry said, uh, "Do you go hunting at all?" Sometimes. Like, I haven't been hunting for years, but I have been hunting, and I probably could go hunting like next week if I wanted to. But um, it's just getting around to doing it. it. It more when I say hunting, it's more pest control, but it is pest control of animals that you can eat. Pete said, "I want to beat off." Mark like said, "He is on one tonight." Harry said, sometimes I beat the wife. <laughs> That's sad. Know what you're starting here, Slingshot. I'm going to lay off the coffee. I'm going to have none yet. <laughs> Slingshot, he said, thanks. Slingshot, he said, thanks, Marcus. Things that having a partner doesn't get you laid all the time. No, I think it goes the other way around, don't it? You have, you have it for a bit, and then you suddenly don't have any. Pete said, named your dick the wife. <laughs> Dad said, jumps or boo. I can't use, I can't have, it can't have been worse than when I looked up bonded trousers for a mate going to a punk party. Fuck's sake. Jim Sarbu said, uh, so much verbal ear bashing with no slow mode. Just like being married. <laughs> Check said, um, we can agree that the most effective weapon against a zombie is a pure testosterone. That is Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> Uh, being said the honeymoon period goes <laughs> uh then you it goes that's it you're basically married 
The endurous hands of the, the, the cat tourniquet is easy enough to use with one hand, and it's recommended way to treat arterial blood. I'll check that out then, mate, because I do need to get one then. But yeah, we can get them over here. Now, said I've been single since January. I'm like a student. Got a good box of tea if I want. <laughs> like, so yeah, get up at midday, watch a bit of a uh, Judge Judy or, or whatever. It used to be Jeremy Carl. <laughs> Sing shot peach. Uh, you know what beating off means in America. <laughs> yeah, but but does sling shot know what having a wank is? Dumbsar Boo said, just about sums up marriage. Uh, being on a period on the on your honeymoon. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Remind me to do the feedback thing on here, complaining about the slow mode. I'll get them to put it on eventually. Get liking everyone. I can see exactly how many likes there are and how many people there are. Twenty-two people, twelve likes. Come on. Because you're more likely to get sent it if you do like. T2 said, uh, got a list of knives to order um, of Blades UK. Anyone have anything off them? Only asking people I haven't thought. No, I've not. I've not had anything off them. Go to Jumbo Sabu. I've been told that the only thing worse than being married uh, is being married and having a daughter. <laughs> Nagging in stereo, apparently. <laughs> Harry said he disliked. That's all right. Dislike if you want. There's always one. Slingshot said, um, and you choose that over a woman, Pete. <laughs> Actually, he's joking. Jack Nash Czech National said, um, do you guys think that there's a gun that looks absolutely like a dingus? I'm not sure. I love the word dingus. I don't know. Um, <laughs> that's a good question. I like that. Bing said, no, I mean honeymoon period being... When you first get together with the fucking <laughs> and the fucking stops and slows down and then it's honeymoon period. I think they're just winding you up there. Scratching my leg. Um <laughs> Richard said this stream took a strange turn. That's an odd one, isn't it? I'm gonna be fucking I'm gonna be dying by the end of this stream. You know, talking I'm having to do because I was fucking uh <laughs> that slow mo was killer it. I said to now, I like being on my own. I wouldn't miss my missus. <laughs> Pete said, Slingshot, your mum's not always available. Oh, joke. For fuck's sakes, Pete. Things I said, Oh, Jumbo, you're a blessed man. Pete, you crack me up. Zed said to Jumbo, Oh, God, nagging in surround sound. I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll have to have a self-imposed slow mode. You've all got to count to 30 before you post another comment. <laughs> That's so. Um, now, said to Marcus, I bet you would. <laughs> I'm just getting fed nice dinners. That's it. They would. Most people, most blokes would. Weapon was after my girlfriend said I'd miss her when we split, but I never... I never miss it close range. <laughs> For fuck's sake. No blast. I didn't expect your your mum reply here. <laughs> well, the slingshot took it as a joke, so that was good. Um, Jumbo Sabu said, that's fucked most of us then. We can't count to 10, let alone 30. <laughs> Czech National. In, um, in one Czech movie, a guy uses a crane to pass him a pen that scene is so hilarious i've seen similar things to that like with the diggers and that t2 said i worship the ground my ex-wife is going to <laughs> you're a bunch of matters tonight isn't you? like i say i'm gonna have to get comfortable for this who's joining in the shooting competition just to confirm for me anyway i've, I've said the people i know definitely are right i've done that Done that, done that, done that. I'm oh, just crossing off my own list. So slingshot is. When I said I will when I get a chance to film it. But yeah, you've got plenty of time. You've got ages. Not write these down quickly. So you you lot will have to email me though still. Jim, right, mate? 
was saying earlier, you missed it. Um, did you watch Jack Stryker's videos? We noticed he's changed his uh, background picture and he's got another video available. And do you want to join in my shooting competition? Like I said, richest bloke, bloke I ever knew owned a crane hire business, thousands of pounds an hour to hire. Yeah, I bet that, I bet that um, yeah. That don't surprise me, Marcus. Yeah, I ain't seen that one, Bing. Bing said, I'll check out your slingshot video later, JBO. Now, I look at that later myself. I've not looked at any videos for a couple of hours. I've been editing the shooting competition one, and then after I did that, I edited another video ready for tomorrow. If if I, I know, I won't be, I was going to say, if I get all the footage, I would do a shooting competition tomorrow. But now, so just ordered one of those foldable slingshot um, target box in the castle. Ah, nice one. You joining in then now? That'd be good. Nice. I just uploaded 12 minutes ago, did he bing? Nice. Yeah, Rich, I put your name down already because I know you definitely are. But no, thank you for answering me. Dim said, I was hoping to join in, but we'll have to sort out some targets and head over to my auntie's farm. And I'll get some worrying looks from the neighbors when I get the collection now. Yeah, that's fine, Tim. Use any, any targets you want and it, you can take your time, mate. Yeah, I look forward to that. So you reckon you will, Tim, if you can. Nice. I just want to put some names down. I know. Oh, yeah, Slings. No, I wrote that, didn't I? Slings said, Amsterdam is where no man is lonely and always satisfied. Yeah, I think you can catch a train to Amsterdam from the UK as well. Pretty much. Um, Marcus said, they're good. I'll use one for air rifle practice. Nice. I'll be good now. Yeah, I'll take you on as a catapult. I'm crap, by the way, so. <laughs> JBO said, yeah, definitely join in. Well up for it. Nice one, Jim. Thank you. What are you going to use? Do you know? It don't matter. You know, you can use anything. In fact, if people want to, you can join in twice. Um, I fixed this today, Jim. This will be, I'll be able to use this for, if anyone uses any lower powered air rifle, like Liam's going to use his um, Daisy Red Rider. I can use this against that because it's a similar power open sights than that. I'll have a video on that tomorrow showing how I fixed it, sort of. Now, so now, thanks, Marcus. I'm glad they're good. Being said, Amsterdam is where you go to get stoned and come home with hepatitis. <laughs> Marcus said to Slingshot, if you ever go to Amsterdam, drop in here, Manchester. Rob, right, mate. Good to see you on. Rob said, lads, lasses, and Mike at work will be listening but can't comment. Now, good to see you on there, Rob. Thank you for uh, listening. Rich said, I'm terrible with a catapult. I'm more accurate to throw a brick. I probably would be as well, to be honest. Debbie, I should probably use my gas pistol, to be fair. What air rifle is that, Mike? I love the stock. Oh, this is an old Slavia 624 Czechoslovakian from the 70s, I think. 60s or 70s. Old as yields. I've had to bodge it ever so slightly, but yeah, it works now. It was so it was so fucked that I had to shoot it four times to get a pellet to come out the barrel, and then it just sort of plopped out. It's shooting about five foot pound now. Then said, enjoyed the Harcourt Henry review vid. Oh, nice one, then. Yeah, I'll tell you what, that's a fucking good film, isn't it? I enjoyed doing the uh, the sort of intro bit for that as well. Now, I'm glad you lot enjoyed that. I didn't have many people comment on it, actually, though. Not as many as last time. But um, maybe I'll have to share it. It's on there for a while, anyway. Maybe people haven't seen it yet. <laughs> Very good film, though, isn't it? I do suspect the hardcore bit means it didn't get shared quite as much. Because I noticed even in the tags, when you write hardcore, it won't pop up as, like, a suggested word. So it's probably one of those words. You put hardcore in, they probably think, oh, no, I won't share that. T2 said, Mike, that's why I need new knives and air pistol combined. I want to win your competition. <laughs> yeah, if anyone wants to join in with throwing knives as well, I think Eric's going to join in with throwing knives, hopefully. Yeah, you know what? It's spears if you want to. A spear, you just have to throw it once, take it out, throw it again. Use the bigger targets, obviously. Czech National said, Collector, how good is um, geography knowledge there? Here, if a guy says he's from... 
how the rod north where i am everybody thinks he's from poland i i wouldn't know at all other people's places i know like my you know, like uk places slingshot said when's the slingshot tutorial it was going to be today or yesterday but i didn't have time to think it. so it'll be next week now maybe monday <laughs> when's i said um should i call it softcore henry to make it more youtube friendly they should do it yeah i know i noticed liam even if you put hardcore in the thing it wouldn't even come up as like a suggested thing. Then said, are you going to do a review on the round, Boo Nice? Don't be too. I, I, I don't know why I didn't. Yeah, I will do. I'll do one on the um, Todd Cutler one as well. The peach kept mentioning that. That's, uh, oh no, I read that. Slingshot said they are called javelins. Okay, javelin then. Nell said your intro was epic, Mike. Oh, thank you. Now I'll tell you what I enjoyed doing that. If I'd had a bit more time, I would have I would have put even more um because I did have some blood and I did put some blood on it, but I thought, oh, I don't know. You never know with YouTube, they're so fucking weird. You know what I mean? Fucking probably block it because it had a bit of you know blood dripping out of a wound on a fucking dummy. <laughs> I don't know what, how, look, when it started getting into the fantasy stuff, though, I don't know how I'm going to do those. I'm, I'm fucking pushing it too far for myself, really. But <laughs> Being said, Lord Slingshot, ask that every time you're on mic. <laughs> You've delayed this video since 1999. <laughs> Jumbo said, watch a video yesterday. Watch the video from yesterday from Frank Stallone, where Sly Stallone was shooting arrows with his kids and Frank. Sly threw the arrow into a tree like a knife. Stuck in first time. And that's, yeah, that's quite impressive, actually, because an arrow is quite um, light, really, isn't it? Patriot Brit said, anyone going to go to sleep? Anyway, going to go to sleep. It's my birthday tomorrow. Hey, you should have said earlier, mate. Happy birthday for tomorrow. If you're on tomorrow, I'll say happy birthday then. But, yeah, have a good one, mate. Then said, do a knife sharpening on the Rambo knife, mate. If it needs sharpening, I will, because the only thing is, that's, that's spotless, that blade. I don't want to scratch it. <laughs> But yeah, if it needs sharpening, I will then. Slingshot said, oh, I delayed myself. Weapons, I said, happy birthday to Patriot Brit. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll look. If it, if I think it needs sharpening, I'll um, give it a bit of sharpen. Weapons, I said, can you sharpen swords? Um, you can sharpen swords, can't you, Mike? I'll be cheeky. <laughs> Get you to give my fortune a quick shaft and oh, slash some. Yeah, no, I'm up for that. I'm up for that. Yeah, we'll do that. Don't worry about that. Now said, yeah, it looked good. Cheers now. I appreciate that. Come on, Bush said, yeah, Mark. Yeah, got to do a review on the first blood knife. You should display the FB knife sheathless, mate. That's what I'm going to do with mine. Yeah, I, I know what you mean. I might do. I'll, I'll think about it. I'm too paranoid to sat underneath them, though. <laughs> I don't think I'd be able to sit underneath it. Jumbo Sabu said, um, yes, the loan was only a few feet away from the tree. Londinium Armory, you right, mate? I saw your uncle's sword earlier. That was fucking nice, that was. Remember, I said, as, I, as I've never given it a decent sharpen, done a bit of an edge maintenance, uh if we forgot to test it properly it ought to be up to scratch yeah i'm up for that mate definitely being said when you when when you're going to mike and liam also we'll be doing a live stream yeah we'll do a live stream q a loads of stuff it'll be around about 14th of september thing shot said can I create a body harness where you can wear most of your weapons right yeah yeah i can i know what you mean yeah Things are sea slingshot. You don't need Amsterdam where Mike's got his escorts sources. <laughs> Cough, Liam. <laughs> yeah, make sure you do say it's a joke afterwards. <laughs> yeah. This ain't too bad for not having a slow mode today, but um, yeah. All right, I'll say that and it'll be mad now. Rich said. If you do an anime or film club, Mike, you'll have to get a body pillow of characters. 
play voiceover clips from the film and dispose of them before anyone in the house sees them. Not a chance, mate. I ain't getting hold of that. I don't want that on my fucking uh, purchase history. <laughs> that that slingshot. He never be able to move with that lot. Yeah, that's a good point, actually. Yeah, I'd just be <laughs> under a pile of weapons, wouldn't I? <laughs> Things that have pimp daddy might ask me. Czech national said a random thought. How many pistols can fit in his pants? Don't know. One, two, three, four, five, about eight, maybe. I was going to do a video of that. You know, you get that um, as a video, and these kids pulling out like a school video about um, school security, wasn't there? And the kids pulling out all these guns from his trousers. I was going to do a piss take of that one day. Bradley McIntosh, right, mate? Weapons I've said, got around to sorting that bone mold armor out. I'm like, no, because I'm building a house instead. <laughs> Then I said, ever tried a Ouija board? Yes, I have. <laughs> London Nymphs and I've got a special video scheduled this year. Um, if you like that Japanese antique I just fixed. My friend has a collection of famous uh, Nihonto. Some are worth 23,000. 17 grand each. I can help. Yeah, I look forward to that. That sounds good. London Nymphs. Now, so that'll be a good one um, of you and Liam. Yeah, he's going to when my um, family are on holiday for the week, because he don't live very, very far away, he's going to come here. He's going to bring a couple of his things. We'll do some tests. We'll do some garden videos, shooting videos, live stream, Q&A, where his viewers and my viewers can ask us both questions and other things. That's just off the top of my head. It should be good, Nell, I can. Being said, I mean, when you're up mics, so you have a video on your YouTube as well. Yeah, he'll film and I'll film. So we'll both be filming. He can make, he can, his footage can be put into his own video. I'll do mine. So there'll be two separate videos for each. Yeah, might even be able to do two live streams. I don't know. We'll work it out anyway. Things like the only thing Mike needs now is hose. When I've said, was it, um, Full reach house, you meant? Yes, I think so. Yeah, that's it. I think it was that one. Can't actually remember now. When I said that's the only one I've built. So it's quite up north, and it was in a snowy kind of area. Being said, that'd be good, Mike. Yeah, I was trying to think. The things I thought about definitely was yeah, live stream, and we might be able to work out a way that we could both. It'll either be live streaming on mine or it might be at a live stream or both at the same time. Um, oh, I did the north one. I can't remember which one it was. Um, yeah, Q&A, where he'll get some questions off of his, I'll get some questions off of mine. That won't be live, though. Yeah, and various other things. T2 said to Len, please, mate, don't fuck with the Ouija board. Oh, what was what was that about then? Oh, Marcus said, no joke, don't ever mess with those, seriously. Then said, not my cup of tea. I'm sorry, Mike, I might even try out three of my crossbows for the comp I haven't even used yet. Yeah, do that, mate, do that. Print off the bigger targets. When you do those targets, you print it off as two separate bits, sellotape them together. Ali, you right, mate? Count all up, you're right, mate. Just having a chat. Anything you want. Marcus at the land, they're bad, mate. Uh, so many stories about bad things happening to people who used them. Um, then said, not for me, mate. I thought I could have, though. <laughs> yeah, if it's a stupid fucking thing you could do, I've probably fucking done it. <laughs> Fuck's sake. And Linium said to me, I just watched some of your videos from like eight years ago and longer, like making crossbow triggers. They were really good. You know what, Londonium? They're my they're my most popular videos, they are. Terrible old quality, aren't they? And funny old talking on them, but I appreciate that. Yeah. Yeah, probably my probably my most popular videos they are. You know, I used to make crossbows all the time. I've got at least five or six, maybe more crossbows in the loft that I made. The only thing that's always a bastard though is making um prods i have got one half made at the minute and i still haven't finished it because i hate doing them not see right mate when i've said our oh, ouija boards are like brexit 
this bad thing happened to me <laughs> because Brexit wage board. <laughs> I reckon that's it. Because originally wage boards was fucking toys, weren't they? It, it's I think it's more the um you know, the fucking the exorcist made them famous for a thing. Before that there was a toy that you buy from fucking uh Marx's, you know, wherever it was. Count all up to them DNA still sell spring assisted knives. Should I Take one for the team for an order once if I get rested. It's up to you, Count Orlock. That's <laughs> right. I had spoke to Tombo for a while, Len, but I know he still is about. Um, he's, he's sort of a bit ill at the minute, like with bad ankles, wasn't it? I think he's got like arthritis in his ankles, so it slowed him down a lot. But yeah, he's still about, and hopefully he'll join the shooting competition. Ali said, When did you make your channel? I think it was 2008. Or 2000, yeah, 2008. Things are sorry, yeah, Mike's house. You're taking any masks other than the ones you're gifting to Mike? Um, how long will it take you to get there? Get to it. Not long, he's not that far from me, really. Jumble Sail Boo said, I was involved in using a <laughs> squeegee board once, <laughs> got in touch with a dead window cleaner. I, I like that, that's good. It's just reading that word squeegee board, man. You fucking are. Pete said he's back, he was on the shitter. Slingshot Warrior said, no, they're not toys, but they're sold as a game to lure people in. Dead said, Ouija boards were sold as toys, yes. Funny thing to do, really, turning necromancy into a game. <laughs> uh, now, so fuck's sake, Jumble Selby, that's funny. It, that was funny, though, wasn't it? It made me laugh now. When I said, just the mask, I'm giving to Mike and the filters. About an hour's drive, I think, at the most. Yeah, it's not, not really far, is it? My problem is, although I don't drive, you know, everything's a bit of a pain in the ass to me. But, um, yeah, you know, I talk to, you know, I trust Liam, do you know what I mean? Um, you know, I talk to him every day now. Uh, yeah, so why not? Ming said, that's not bad drive. Yeah, tra well, funny thing is, when my, I have an American mate who comes over, Londonian, and um, that is what we did. We took a train. To Liam's area, but it was at the time I didn't even think of saying to him, "Do you want to meet up?" But yeah, trains is yeah. I you know when we go to London or whatever, I do take a train. I don't mind trains; I find them quite relaxing. Tim said, "Prepper shop are still selling plenty of knives with flippers too." Well, we decided we reckon flippers are all right. All right, Dom Sabu said, "Have you ever done a ghost shit? You know, the one where you hear a plop, you look down, and it's disappeared around the bend." <laughs> So, I didn't the trains are really good for getting around the UK. I always use them. I quite, I quite enjoy trains. If that, you know. Uh, Mitch said, "Woolworths used to." That's it, Woolworths. Then a hundred years ago, they used to hang you for witchcraft for a Ouija board. Was they older than that? Then I didn't know that. That's that's a bit of ignorance on my part. I thought they was just the um, Woolworths things, and they'd never been around before. Uh, <laughs> I've said the Virgin bus went to Chad train. Exactly. <laughs> Fuck them buses, I tell you, no way. But yeah, I like trains, I find them quite relaxing. I need to if you live in London, owning a car is pointless luxury. Only good if you need to transport mass tools around the car. Yeah, that's a very good point there. Yeah. Oh, Kenny B, hello, mate. Sorry, I missed your um comment there. Good job, Nell was saying hello to you. Yeah, Kenny B, all right? Yeah, I, yeah, I don't mind train. You know, travelling trains. But I fucking hate buses, though. <laughs> I think that's just bad memories. Uh, pizza now, nah, but... Um, live the old time when you <laughs> take a dump and wipe yourself. <laughs> but it's still... Clean like what the fuck? <laughs> Impossible. <huh? laughs> and Liam said they have made it so London is terrible for car owners. So public transport is actually faster by far and no charges. <laughs> oh, but you love the old times when you have a dump and you don't need to wipe yourself. And Liam said, "Yeah, buses I don't use. Uh, now we even use trains underground and overhead." What was Harry saying? I missed something there. T2 saying, yeah. 
a long time ago, wasn't it? Don't say, it's funny how history repeats itself. The witch finder general nowadays hunts down those who vote for Brexit. <laughs> yeah, there's fucking there's witch finders all over fucking Twitter in that now, isn't there? Say one wrong thing. Fuck me. Seems like the London Bridge has fallen down. Rob said, Ouija boards translated is yes, yes board from French. Oh, yeah, of course, yeah. Bradley said, what is those snowflakes? <laughs> Took the high emoji away. That's bizarre, isn't it? Twitch finder general, fuck's sake. How did I not think of that? <laughs> Tim said, that's why they call it a ghost boo. Kenny B said, dumps and Ouija boards, interesting topics. That's what I mean, Kenny. You can Anything comes up on my streams, if I'm honest. Richard, ask me, Peach. I'll wipe and the paper is still clean because sometimes there's hair on the paper. <laughs> right, Charles. Good to see you on, mate. And on Twitch the other day, that was you on Twitch, wasn't it? Zed's had slingshot. We wouldn't know London Bridge is in the US now. <laughs> the gun emoji. That's it. Yeah, it's weird that they take away these things. I think there's still one on here, though. Someone put the gun emoji on. Mitch and I had a Ouija board. Use the target now. Uh, <laughs> A long time ago. And the answer, don't ever eat while reading this stream chat. Ha, <laughs> for fuck's sake. Yeah, food will eventually come up as well. Not C, said the Bradley. I thought they turned the gun emoji into a water pistol. Don't make me look at the fucking emoji. That's wasted time while I've got a fucking... Uh, I'm supposed to be reading here. Come on. One of you lot should have done this for me. I think they've got knives on here and everything, haven't they? Sure, they used to have a knife on here. Objects. Come on, you bastard. Don't make me look at this for fucking ever. Yeah, they got rid of someone here as well. I thought they had a gun and a fucking knife on here. They got a kitchen knife. Right, anyway. Rob said, did you hear about the bloke that ran over by a lorry? You know, HCV positive. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Um, right. Then I said, Mike, save the Patriot money for a Patreon money for a few decades and get an old Jaguar. Worth it down like that. I'd love that. I would love that. Cobb, you right, mate? Charles says he found his way on. And then he said, um, you know what videos I think will be good for your channel? More outdoor cooking like that pit you did. I think people like the camping um, barbecue. I'll tell you what, London, they do. They really, they really, they really are quite popular. Popular, they are. Yeah, they do. People do like them, don't they? Randy said, I used to be, it used to be a revolver. That's it. Not C, he said, nice. To see it hasn't been purged, we'll never understand people's fear of in inanimate objects. Gain said, Yeah, London cooking uh, big steaks on a smoking grill. Nell said, That must have been why I never had any luck when I was married to a Frenchman. <laughs> Bing said, I'm with you there, Londonian. Moxie said, I see a revolver. It's because I'm using Firefox. Maybe I've had to go on Chrome today because I couldn't do a fucking live stream unless I was doing Chrome. But I'll definitely want to do more outdoor videos. It's just getting around to doing it. Uh, Rich said your brother does outdoor videos. Well, yeah, he does quite often because um, he works outside all the time, so it's a bit easier for him. And they've also got a yard where he can do his traps. And there are actually animals down there you can trap as well. Although he doesn't show it just because of, um, you know, we, we know the old snowflakes. You know what I mean? But, yeah, he quite often traps things and eats things and... Yeah, uh, Dom Sabu said, yeah, heard the guy who got run over by HCV. He's now retired due to being exhausted. <laughs> Mate said, cooking with weapon collector. Well, people keep telling me to do that as well. I said, I need a new kitchen first. Otherwise, I'm going to have to do it on a barbecue or something. Tim said, Mike, can you see the um, emojis we've put up? <laughs> no, I don't know why. All the fucking emojis are coming off squares for me, but that's just me because I'm using the shitty old um, web browsers. Typical, do not it? But I'm, I think it's because I'm on Windows 7. But I can see that the emojis have been put on, but they're just squares. 
Bing said, um, you being out in the woods would be class, Mike. I see you do a wild camp and what knives you'd take in your setup. It's definitely an option. Now I've set up that base as well, which which is good. That's a jump so I thought he would have been I thought he would have retired, to be honest. You lucky and free are terrible. It said, um, what are the shotguns on display there, bud? I'm assuming they are not the real deal. Well, they're deactivated. So they are real shotguns. That one is a Magtech pump action shotgun. That's a double barrel. That's a single barrel. They're deactivated. And that one's a BB gun, Spaz 12. Cooking with weapons. I'll tell you what, Londinian. Let me find my list of... If I showed you my list of um, videos, wait a minute. You look at this. There's my list of videos to do it, videos to do. Right, wait a minute. I want to show you this. Videos. Right, hang on a minute. I want to show you something here. Right, where is it? Just there. Cooking with weapons. <laughs> uh, Sabu said, Zed, that's what I meant, mate. Like him said, like backyard samurai, cooked a rack of ribs with a crown bit. Yeah, that sounds good. T2 said, would love to see hunting and cooking vids. Now said, seeing his traps on Instagram. Yeah, Mac does some good stuff like that, don't he? Count all said, waiting on deactivated musket to arrive. Normally, ignore deact muzzle loaders, but this one was a good price. Yeah, sounds good. JBOs had ordered a, um, ordered a catalogue today from that new idea you had for Suba. Oh, from the, yeah, from the idea he had for the Suba and the Manuki. Yeah, nice one, Jim. And he said he's psychic. <laughs> Bradley, yeah, or even that or Great Man Shrink alike, isn't it? Bradley said, do you have any guns that shoot? I've got air rifles, crossbows, the crossbows, you know, um, BB guns, air guns, air pistols. Yeah, I've got stuff. Not, I ain't got no firearms, if that's what you mean. <laughs> Not C. He said, every time I see someone say, it's deactivated, I think of a farmer from Hot Fast banging on that C mine. <laughs> now said, um, <laughs> beating up slingshot. <laughs> I think he has, hasn't he? Kenny said, just out of interest, Mike, what part of the UK are you from? I'm from Wolverhampton. Uh, I can understand if you don't want to share this anymore. Buckingham shares. I'll, I'll go as far as Buckingham share. I don't like to go too detailed. Do you know what I mean? I think so. said, are you really psychic, uh, Mandinio? <laughs> now said, not see, I love that film. What's he saying? Oh, yeah. Oh, hot fuzz. Yeah. Richard said, I could see someone roasting a pig and performing sword cuts to serve it. But that would be good, wouldn't it? I don't think I've got the cat. The patron would have to go off a bit for me to be buying a pig. I know you don't mean that, Richard. Yeah. For me to do that. Ted said to Jumbo Tower Blue, said, mind joking aside, outside a place I used to work, a young schoolboy tripped and his head went under the wheels of an Arctic. Not a pretty sight. No, I bet that fucking wasn't. Fuck's sake. Yeah. I've got a good imagination. I can fucking picture that. Thing shot said, well, now, just have to save on batteries. <laughs> and then he said, he actually is. Yeah, he is. But, yeah, as soon as I saw cooking with weapons, I thought, yeah, that's on my list. That's, that's been, that's been, I, what I ought to do is write down a bit of the date when I wrote, wrote these down. Then you'll know how long I've been fucking, um, Planning after these things, but I never get round to. Now said, okay, if you've got rechargeable ones. <laughs> Things up said, what exactly can you see, Londonian? That said, it's not something you forget. That's for certain. Yeah, I imagine, mate. I can imagine. Being said, she's got solar panels set up to charge us. Cry on, you right, mate? So, did I tell you all about the... Uh, who out of you lot joined the Twitch that time? If any of you lot enjoyed the Twitch, 
not the Twitch. So ignore. Right, I'll start again. Who who out of you lot watched my game streams the other week and enjoyed those? If you want to do that more, join Twitch. The Twitch is it's easy to set up, and I I think Londonium's on. Not Londonium, sorry. I'm Mass Martin's on there. Nell's on there. Richard, Liam, Peach, Bing. <coughs> um, they're on there. And you can have the same chat as you do, but it's because I don't want to fill this up with um, game streams. But if you want to join, just make the account. It's not like you, it's not like YouTube where you have to sift through loads of videos. As soon as I come on, you just go to my page and it's on there. And the chat say you don't have to find the video, nothing. You just go on my page, it's there. Um, and you can have a you can have a chat in the week with me then. I, I do them sort of Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Um, if you want to. It's, it's fucking piss easy to do. <laughs> Richard said to JBO, cool, I hope you find some stuff uh, in the DCI and catalogue. Useful those um, backing plates. Should be easy to drill being mild steel. Make supers. Randy said, can you own guns without a license where you live? <laughs> not firearms you can't you need you need certain licenses but you can own them firearms yeah Bing, but yeah air rifles and that Bing said i recommend doing a twitch account it's very easy to make an account and it's not even about the game it's just another way to talk about what you've about what we're doing here yeah thank you for mentioning that yeah well len join twitch um i, I do if you liked if you enjoyed the ones on here join twitch and um it's the exact same thing. It's just I can't I can't put too much on. I don't like putting too many game things on YouTube. It bogs it down. Yeah, it, yeah. The thing is, that's a good point though, Bing. Yeah, the um, the game is irrelevant really. It's just I can't do web streams on the PlayStation Four, and I play the games in the evening anyway. But but while I'm playing the game, we can have a chat just like this. It's just you'll see a game. And so, but eventually, I'll buy a camera and you'll be able to see me in the corner. This I, I would highly recommend Len joining up Twitch, and then find it, my channel, my um Twitch channel, is just Weapon Collector. Bradley said not even flamethrower, probably I doubt it. But you know, shotgun licenses aren't hard to get. That's a part one. I remember when a Brockle went and got himself drowned. The poor bugger, he was dragged up in a trawler net a few days after. Now said only takes a few minutes, and well worth it. Thank you. Now, there are. There are. There's a recommendation for now, Bing, and I'm sure Richard and Liam and um, Peach would say, yeah, do it. It's, it's easy, and there's, they're always on there. I, like I said, Iron Man's on there now. So um, you can imagine the things Iron Man comes out with. <laughs> yeah, Nell's on there. Yeah, fucking do it. <laughs> But the thing is, it's piss easy to do. And you can have a... Oh, Jumbo's up booze on there, isn't he? The rig's on there. I forgot about that. <laughs> no, I can't. <laughs> I forgot rig's on there. Yeah, Jumbo's up booze on there. Here's the link if you want to do it. Click that. Go and make an account. And then bookmark that page. Moxie said to me, shotguns are really, really easy to get right. Don't need a good reason. And buckshot in and over and under... Uh, and a two plus one pump is very effective. Buckshot, I think you may need some kind of, you may need a firearm license to get that. I'm not sure, but yes, shotgun are pissy pissy you get. I know people who live in flats who own shotguns. <laughs> Mitch said, hoping an air gun license doesn't come into England and Wales. Like, it. yeah, I hope it doesn't. It'd be a nightmare. I'll have to get one though if it does. They're their part two. They bought him out of the trawler wrapped in a blanket, but his arm slipped out and the crabs had been at him. Not pretty either. Nearly put me off my food for the day. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Rowley said, I could not live there. I can't live without my guns. What if someone breaks into your house and you don't have a flamethrower or an AR-15? Well, they won't have one either. That's the thing. That mean, Rita said, what's your fucking language, Peach? <laughs> D2 said, watched a film earlier. Um... With her called The Darkest Minds. She enjoyed it. I thought it was absolutely shit. Uh, what a waste of an hour and a half of my life. 
I don't know that one. The Darkest Minds. No, I don't know that one. But yeah, come on. I want to see some fucking names like they're on here saying you've added me as friends on Twitch. But yeah, what you see, if you if you click that click that link, I'll put it on again just to make sure. Being said, type in Derek and Clive Cunt on YouTube for a picture of two old men from the Muppets. <laughs> I'm not putting that in. I'll look for a picture of two men. I know the Derek and Clive thing, though. That is um, Dudley Moore and uh, I can't remember his name, but I know who they are because Ian Lee's put me on to them before listening to his radio show. Peter Cook, that's it. I couldn't remember. Yeah. Yeah, no, I have I have listened to them. But yeah, if you click that link to go to the uh, Twitch, that page is it. That's it. You don't need to go looking through videos. There's just that one player and the chat next to it. That's how it is. Um, or you can set it up on a phone. That's it, Dad. Yeah, I couldn't think. I could picture him. Yeah, Peter Cook. Kenny said, yeah, weapons and stuff burn your house down too. Oh, sorry, I missed that. Weapons and stuff. A flamethrower sounds like a really sensible choice for home defence. Yeah. Yeah, who would... <laughs> yeah, I missed that one. Bradley, so a person breaks into a house in the US, you get a flamethrower, set house on fire, well done. Job well done. Yeah, exactly. Being said, they was like the original podcast, but on radio. That's it. I'll tell you how I know. Ian Lee... When he used to do it, well, he still does it now when he does his radio show. Quite often mentioned them. <laughs> when I said your house will be well done for certain. <laughs> Getting a terrible dry mouth at the minute. It's only fucking ten past fucking a quarter past ten. <laughs> I'm gonna struggle for two hours for this one, I tell you. Oh, my nose is blocked as well. Barely breathe through it. Richard said, I wonder if you can get flamethrower that classes as a lighter. Um, if you do, you need to add one to your lighter collection video. That's to Liam. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Come on, all quiet now. There's no slow mode, so... Oh, actually, yeah, saying that, Pete, yeah, weed burners, that's exactly it. Yeah, well, you forgot about them, yeah. One didn't even say blow torches are all flamethrowers when out at a certain angle. <laughs> are you saying about them fucking weed burners? We got one of them in the shed. The funny thing is, when it was shown to me, it was described as a flamethrower. Kenny said they can't break into your house if they don't, uh, you don't have one. Like so, you've mentioned that, hasn't you? Yeah. Yeah. Liam said, I thought you meant 420 weed burner then. Richard said, uh, you get some blow torches for roofing. That's it. Yeah. Nimble said, boosted weed burns and crack pipes. Now said, Iron Man must be on Twitch waiting for us all. I reckon, he, I reckon he is. Either that or he's still in fucking bed like he was last night now. I know you weren't on, was you? He was still in fucking bed last time. And then he said, I have a Chinese pen torch before. And when held upside down, it shoots a four foot flame out and destroys your work project. And I've said, soon the Yanks will be saying, 
unless you can own a nuke for home defense, you have no rights. <laughs> Bing said, just use a Lynx can and a lighter. That's it. That's it. That's all you need. Randy said, you need to check out M Best One's channel. He does that thing when he snaps girls' clothing. Clothing turns in bikini. When he snaps girls' clothing turns in bikini. Oh, Turn, when he snaps, girls' clothing turns into a bikini. That's what he's saying. Not Cecil, I recently discovered that trespass is not an offence in the UK unless you break into a military base, etc. I can't make up my mind if that's good or bad. It's giving me a couple of fun ideas. Not C, yeah. Jumbo Salbu knows a bit about that. That it's it's only... um. Well, if, if he's on and you've seen this, hopefully he'll explain. But I think you know what you, it means, do you, don't you? Pocket full, you right, mate? The same shot where I said he's back. All right. Good to see you back. I didn't know you'd gone. I was unaware you weren't even here. And Liam said it's good because trespassing can be accidental when walking around the field. That's true, actually, isn't it? Yeah. Or your dogs run off into the woods and you have to follow it accidentally. <laughs> no, I know what you mean. You can, but you generally can accidentally trespass, can't you? Ted said to weapon stuff, you mean you can't own a nuke for home defense? Ah, oh, be right back. <laughs> I'll get rid of something. My name said there's different kinds of trespass, and aggravated trespass, and it's not legal. That's it. I was going to say, um, Double Shell Boo knows a bit about that. He's been a, I think he's been a um, groundskeeper and other things. Uh, yeah, he knows a bit about that. He's probably, that's the only reason I know anything about it is through him. Things up in America, we have uh, bigger swathes of land. And Liam said, that's when you refuse to leave someone's property and it becomes classed as a criminal trespass. A nice one, yep. Yeah. Dumble Sabu said, trespass is civil, but if you climb over a fence or um, Harris fencing, it's classed as a criminal trespass. Okay, so it depends on how your trespass is committed and the, the reason for it. I'm doing sure I was an underkeeper and ex-police. Bing said, I walked over some woodland where I usually go camping. Me and my mate jumped the fence. That had no signs. And it's a wildlife preserve. And we got asked to leave. Pocketful said, are you going to make a film review of Hellraiser, please? Oh, definitely. I'll tell you what, hell, um... Horror hasn't come up, has it? I'll have to rig that so horror comes up soon. <laughs> There'll be sci-fi horror, traditional horror, uh, comedy horror. <laughs> but yes, Hellraiser 100% definitely will be coming out one day pocket full. Not seen, so if a gate is unlocked, they're all good. Then I said, what's your favourite lighter, Mike? I don't know. I, I always loved the Zippos, and I always liked the old brass. I had brass b and Zippos. But for pure ease of use and repeated use, I like a clipper, in all honesty. And the white clipper, or the clear clipper, because they're not quite clear, but the clipper you can see the gas in. That's like got everything you want, I think. And Liam said, or if you are evicted from a house or nightclub or pub, uh, when security tell you, if you refuse to, if you leave, if you refuse to stay, if you, yeah, hang on. Tell you to leave if you refuse and you stay. Now you're a criminal trespassing. Leo, right, mate? But, yeah, pocket full. That'll definitely come up. I wouldn't mind. Um, yeah, I'll have to do some peeling off skin or something. Yeah. Julia's skin, that's it. You need some nails and Julia's skin, definitely. Being said, didn't know that, London. That's, um, that's a new one to me. It's interesting, isn't it, Bing? That's why I like when some of these topics come up. You do learn things. I learned quite a few of the um, trespass and stuff through through double sort of boom mentioning it before. That's it, London. Yeah, that's what I thought you meant. It's a, sometimes I struggle to um, read it out. So you sort of I was suggesting raids from Mars. Is that one of Jack Nicholson in, or is that something else? Now said, yeah, with all the fields there, you always get the angry farmer doing a barber Windsor. Get off my land. <laughs> yeah, get out of my pub. I said, Mike, I have such sights to show you. Fortune rifle sights and all. 
No, o sea, a mí que es Um, things that said, what are you picking up on um, LZI? I don't know what that is. Kenny said, um, I own six acres of land and I put up a sign on my gate. Trespassers will be shot. Trespassers will be shot again. I was asked by West Midland Police to take it down. It's, yeah, it's ridiculous, isn't it? Neo said, opinions on British Home Guard. Uh, I, I think there's um, a lot more. Right, there people take the piss out of them because of um, Dad's Army, but there, there's a lot better than that. I've got the Home Guard manual, and that you know, I've read the Home Guard manual anyway. Um, yeah, there's a lot of you know, they would have been our last defense, and you know, a lot of them was ex you know, ex soldiers, military, just a bit older, isn't they? You know, a lot of them was in World War One. They knew their shit, definitely. Kenny B said, yeah, Vice City. Fair to invades from Mars, the one with the kid in the sun. Oh, it's that one. It's actually the one that, yeah. Bing said, I think, I think we need national service instead of prison. He's got to it easy. <laughs> I never know what to think of that one. Because I, in a way, I, do, I agree with it. But if I was to age that we had to do it, I'd say don't. I wouldn't want to. <laughs> yeah, I do remember that bad lad's army, though. Yeah. Yeah. I watched a couple of episodes of that. Dumble Sail Boot. So trespass is a civil matter. If the landowner asks you to leave and you refuse... Um, they can use reasonable force to remove you or call the police and they will remove you to prevent breach of the peace. Not C says shooting black powder pistols in the UK. I've never done it, but yeah, um, someone else might have to answer you on that. That's the one, Mike. Starts out creep and slightly scary. Said, <laughs> is that the one that I wanted you to tell me? Like, is that the one I asked about that time? Is that the one? That said to Bing, oh, great, take a load of violent offenders and teach them how to kill efficiently. <laughs> but I know what you mean. I, I do know what you mean. Um, oh, it, it is actually the one. Oh, that will probably that might come up one day then. On um, Yeah, because I do want to watch that. I've, I've got a feeling next, the next one after this one will be um, it's going to be a new film. It's going to be something I've not seen. So it'll be any category. I'm just going to pick a film I've not seen before. Richard said, don't know if it would make any difference. Mexico's national service, and it's full of criminals. No offense. Yeah, that's the thing. What I wonder what difference it would make. But I understand. Yeah. If I was the age that they had to do it, I'd say no, bro. <laughs> but um, yeah, well, I don't know. <laughs> Gone quiet again. Now said the France still have national service. I'm not sure. I ain't sure about that. What's the fucking oh yeah, I don't know that. Liam said he thinks they might do, yeah. Don't have we don't have any French viewers, do we? Can't ever remember anyone saying they was from France on here, or originally from France. Brent said, "One of my mates came to England specifically to get out of French national service." I'll be honest, I don't blame them. That's the, you know, <laughs> Nintendo Wii Wii. I never knew you could speak French, Pete. Things that said it's about a boy who sees a UFO. Started to notice strange things um, were happening in the little America. That's it, things I've seen that years ago. 
Number seven, Bruce, you know, still have national service in France. Hey, teach you how to run away. <laughs> now, Liam said, I once lived with a French housemate in West London. There are about six of us renting a five-bedroom house. Fuck's sake. Liam yeah, so said, I don't think we should have national service in a regular army, but I think we should recreate a national guard where half of the soldiers uh, goes home every night and half stay on. Yeah, on in. Oh, that's quite a good idea, yeah. Now see their weapons off. That's how I ended up with a Frenchman. <laughs> <coughs> Kennedy said national service to criminals who keep reoffending, yeah, petty crimes. I rush through the fucking comments to get him read, then it's only a quiet fucking man. <laughs> Dad said it's on my 50s and 60s playlist if you want to watch it. I've got it bookmarked, mate. I remember you saying. Bradley said, Do you have any gas masks? Just one, and it's over there. If you want to see it. When, it, when we get a little bit of a. See that bag just there? There's my M61 V2 just there. And then you said the French guy and the Korean guy were always having arguments about not wearing shoes in the kitchen. That's uh, that don't surprise me though. Just the kind of thing you'd imagine them doing. <clears throat> Richard said, I um, also I doubt the government would want to pay folks for their service. Greedy bastards will look for any excuse to um not pay out. Things so said the boys in many ways becomes an unlikely hero. Yeah, I've seen it things. So I saw it absolutely years ago, right? And I always remember it being really good. It goes a bit mental at the end, don't you? I think. And then about a month ago, we was talking about it on um on on a live stream, and said we worked out what it was purely because I um I described what a part of the film, and the part of the film was the was the fence. With the light behind it, and then by saying that, that happened to be like the um, see, like Pete, that happened to be like the, the the famous cover for it, and then yeah, I found out what it was. What's that now? We have board still. Have you spelt it? Not sure. <laughs> But yeah, see you later. Um, and Bradley, if you have to go, <laughs> if you have to go, you have to go. See you later. When I still not found the name out of the film with the blonde guy on the island of mutants. No, I've given up on that one, Liam. That'll be. I'll have to just. Uh, I think I'll never know that. I don't know enough detail for it. I've given up on that one. I've just had to accept it. <laughs> If you like that, you're like 80s cloak and dagger. I didn't even say, have you guys in Wales ever climbed Snowdonia? I did it a few times. Yeah, Nels from Wales and um, was it Leo? Yeah, Leo Taylor, yeah. I've never done anything like that, London, him, to be honest. Don't say the weapons and stuff. The island of Dr. Moreau. Not sure how I spelled it right. No, it's not that. He's, I'll tell you what it was, Dad. I, I tried to ask, I asked Liam to ask his mate, who knows a lot of weird, obscure films, if he could work out what a film was. And the only thing I can remember is it's from, it's got to be pre-90s film or very early 90s, a pre-90s horror sci-fi film. I remember the, the main bloke in it had very blonde hair. It may have even been foreign, dubbed English. Um, this will sound weird, but the main actor, if he was speaking English, didn't look English. He looked like he was, you know, like um, Klaus Klinsky, is it? You know, you he doesn't look English. I know that he's white, but he doesn't look English. Do you know what I mean, if that makes sense? Anyway, the main bloke in this, he's got either very blonde hair or white hair. At the very beginning of the film, the bloke's parents get shot with an Uzi. And then there's a bit later where he's on a, what's them things that you would, like a barge type thing. You park your cars on it. So you park about 20 cars on it and then it goes across water. And there's like a 20 minute scene with that and possibly some weird mutants or something. 
or maybe people with diseases or something. And then there's bits of tunnels later. That's the only that's the only stuff I can remember. I've never ever been at work at what it's called. <clears throat> Londonium said I like Wales, so many mountains and sheep everywhere. Nell said Londonium, I've got a train up there. Bloody amazing, isn't it? Um Singh sort of said, What are your abilities, Londonium? He wants to know your psychic abilities. Leah said, going for a run, but I'll be back on in ten minutes. No, for your slot. I should be, mate, I should be. Liam said they have these great rugged mountain goat kind of things that make you really uh, that make you really pissed off when they zoom past you easily. And Liam said, I don't want to say in the chat things up. Um, sounds post apocalyptic. Yeah, I'd never ever been at work out what it was. This fucking film. Um, it, we had it on video. It was part of when we used to get the old. Used to be able to get buy one, no, pay for one, get nine free. And um, but you didn't have to pay till you got them. No, Doc Savage. I do not. No, it's a young bloke. The main bloke is about twenty, say. Um, and he's not much. He's not like muscly or anything. No, Doc Savage. That's good, isn't it? I like that. Kenny and I own three tough little horses. Are they said from what you've said? <laughs> what I've heard sounds like Disneyland. Yeah, I ain't got a fucking clue, on, and I don't think I'll ever know what it is. I've given up on it. Bradley said, before I go, will you be streaming? Uh, make sure you check out M Best Eleven. All right, yeah. Oh, when will I be streaming again? Tomorrow, 9 to 11. Kenny B said, unfortunately, I learned in history that King Henry VIII tried to kill them all because he couldn't ride them. <laughs> what horses or his missus is? Yeah, I've given up on that film. Yeah, whoever's off, see you later. But yeah, all I remember is the beginning, the bloke's parents being shot with an Uzi, some like assassin coming in the house and shooting shooting the mum and dad with an Uzi. And then him being older, very blonde hair, but he doesn't look English. I know that sounds odd, but does that make sense to you? Um so I don't I don't think it was an American film or even an English film. But it may have been like an Italian film with American voices dubbed on it. <clears throat> but um that may I may not I may be wrong there. And then there's the bit on the barge and then tunnels later on. Or un they're underground or something. These fucking weird people running around. Might might have zombie elements to it. Shot said I can relate to invaders from Mars. I have a situation like that happen in my childhood. Come on, you've got to tell us now. You can't say that and not tell us. That's just sound like you're something Italians would make. Now said, when I find the man of my man of my dreams that can cook, I want to get married off the off the top of um, Snowdonia. Now yeah, that'd be good. Not see uh shot of a newsy. No, definitely not pulp fiction. <laughs> Being said back now, I have to go for five minutes without my daughter as she was restless. I forget it's that time, yeah. Weapons off, yeah, I imagine it was an Italian or Spanish movie. Done. That's what I think it was. It, from what I can remember, it's someone. It's, it's a shame I cannot, in the and I've asked Malcolm, he can't remember. I don't think he can remember any of it. Things such as I have a childhood trauma involving government. Oh, right. I don't, you don't have to say then. You know. Yeah, I hope your daughter's uh, back to sleep, Bing. You know, if you want. Um, yeah. She, I didn't wake her up, did I? <laughs> I imagine my voice would put people to sleep, not wake them up. I like the ones where people told me that their missus was complaining because they could hear some droning bloke in the background. <laughs> I've heard that a couple of times. It always cracks me up. The best thing, though, is when they let me talk to them, though. Being I can't uh, stand... I can't stand it. have to cook, clean the whole house, plus try to squeeze some fitness in at night. Yeah, that's hard work. I can imagine... Did I tell you lot I've bought I've bought the board for fuck's sake, it's always backwards in here. There. 
There's going to be a new display coming here soon. <laughs> this nice one might make me laugh. <laughs> yeah. I quite often get people saying, oh, my missus has just told me to put my earphones on because there's some droning bloke in the background. It's me they're all about. <laughs> uh, now, so I don't mind cleaning or ironing. Uh, but not like the cooker bing. Yeah, I don't do ironing, but cooking's all right. I don't mind cooking. Zed said, what are you going to put on the new board? You know what? I'm not sure, Zed. I've got quite a few things I could, though. I'm tempted to put a crossbow on there. I, I might get the um, barnet down, put that on there. I'll have to think about it, though. Because there are, there are two crossbows already up, so I don't really need to. When I've got the board, I'll start getting some stuff out, see what looks good, see what does you know deserves to go up. Things so I'll just say this: I've dealt with a corrupt government at an early age. Mac forty five said, "Can you say Josh Heath buggers cats?" Um, right. When I've said it's not this, is it, Mike? All right, hang on. I'll get that link to open. Um, I'd, I'd have to have a proper look in a minute. Let me see. I can't remember Michael Moriarty being in it. No, I don't think so. Cheers, Eddie, and I appreciate that. But no, I don't think it is. I'll have a proper look later, but at first glance, I don't think so. <laughs> that What that shows, that sort of DVD cover there, whatever it was, was posted, definitely, I've never seen that before. But then they can be different for different things, can't they? No, so that sounds rough. Yeah, that does sound terrible, things like that. So I um, you know, it wasn't too bad, whatever, you know, or that you've, you've got over it, if you know what I mean. Kenny B said, that, you know what I mean, get out. that's not what I mean, but you know what I mean. Kenny B said, government are supposed to be corrupt, unfortunately. Bing said, clean, as in dusting, hoovering, cleaning, bathroom, utilities. Yeah, I don't do ironing. I don't do ironing either. That's an either that or a dinghy in Bala Lake. All right, where am I? I found a screenshot of a screaming fake blonde man and mutants. Oh, and that's where you found that. Right, where is it? Twitch. Things shot my childhood was a bit, a bit of sweet now. And Dean said, Mike, you should, um, you should do that. That's a good earner. Sell insults as well as um, shout outs. <laughs> Call my friend a piece of shit for two quid. <laughs> I can record screen. Yeah, that kind of... That's a good idea. Yeah, I'll have to think about that one. <laughs> if I could do the Super Chat, I would do that. I can't fucking do the Super Chat, sadly, but that'd be perfect for that, yeah. Super Chat for um, insults. Now I said, find iron in therapeutic, yeah. I, I can see what you mean by that. <clears throat> Things like that do my head in. I you know, I hate painting. Fucking hate it. Uh, drives me up the wall. <laughs> it's too monotonous. I think I said, um, God was a major factor in my healing. I said, yeah, probably not right, but I'm doing a search again. Nice one, mate. But I know, yeah, it's a good way to do it. I have found things doing that. Being said, I find Hoovering does that now. Ken said, Mike, why don't you put a shield on there? Could do. The only problem is it would take up a lot of area, wouldn't it? I know, I, I know what you mean, no. Nice run, Jim. The humble Ronin. Nice. All right. Can't wait to see you on there. I won't be back on there till um, Monday, but yes. Yeah, I suppose I'll, I'll have to make one for it, wouldn't I, um, London? I have. I made the riot shield recently. It's, it's not there now. What do I do with it? I'll put it in the loft. But yeah, I know what you mean. Nice shield. Maybe some swords coming out of it. Old traditional sort of displays. Thinking a Viking shield or a modern right shield? 
My my right shield I just made. I've just put in the loft. Now said I ask all family members if they want me to do theirs. But we need someone like that around here to do our ironing. No one does it here. And Liam said might make an interesting creation video. Yeah, I'm into. I am. I I do want to make more shields. This is getting the wood for it after time for me. Slingshot, yeah, Fright Night. Um, Liam will be watching that soon. Have you ever have you watched it yet, Liam? I want to see what this picture was. Nice trailer. Right, let's have a look. That looks like a quite quite a weird film that there. But yeah, the bloke's younger than that. But he but you're right about that's the kind of hair I mean. That sort of the bloke's got sort of hair that um doesn't look real. You know, like it's bleach blonde or whatever. It doesn't look right. But I've downloading it at the moment. Uh should be done Monday. Watching um, Rawhead Rex every day. Oh, did you watch it? What did you think of it? I was good laugh. I'll watch that soon. I might watch it. Tomorrow in the day, Rawhead Rex. I've watched bits of it. It looks absolutely mental. Being said, could you use that Kydex mark that you was on about yesterday for a full body armor? You could. It's, I don't know how big you can get Kydex so cheaply. Normally, you can only get it like A4 unless you use, you know, unless you start cutting bits. Not overlapping. But, yeah, that's Definitely could work. Thing with a shield, I've noticed a uh, bit of ply, you know, 12 mil ply or 8 mil ply, um, 9 mil ply is good enough for a shield for most things with a bit of an edge around it and a bit of steel on. And it's light. Not to say that I'm not a slob, but I do not iron anything. Now said, time for another Twitch link. For it. <laughs> Let's see if I still got it on here. Oh, yes, I have. There you go. Yeah, get on there. See, Jim's on there now. But yeah, if you in, if you was one of the people that joined those um, the game streams, and you enjoyed it, join join Twitch. You know, I'm on there four four days a week, and then there's these two. So it's like six days a week I do streams. Uh, Being said, overlap at the joints. Use fiberglass and resin as well. Yeah. Oh, so, oh, sorry, Rich. Good night, mate. See you later. Saya, all right? Sorry if that's not how you say your name, but Saya, hello, yeah. So many weapons. Teachers of the Frighteners is a good one. Yeah, I like that. That's Peter Jackson, isn't it? I knew shit. I didn't even say shit. I ran out of Rizzlers. And I have to fight my way through hordes of drunken idiots and go to the shops. The LB. Yeah, I'd rather. <laughs> Ain't you got a Bible? <laughs> Some are a bit of a. Uh, I think so. Well, I said B movies made outside of Hollywood were big in the eighties. Yeah, I'm quite into B movies. I like them. Now I said I'm only four foot nine, uh, so painting is too much for drama. <laughs> yeah, I suppose for you it'd be like climbing up top of a ladder, wouldn't it? I ain't. I'm, I must admit, I ain't. I am. You know, I'm a bit taller than you, but I ain't. I'm. I am classed as short myself now. Don't forget to get your merchandise in, everyone. Finally, 20 viewers, 20 likes. Kenny said, family coat of arms or local area seems nice. I've got a thing where I went, um, they're probably made up, but I went to a, I can't remember what it was, but you could find out what your, your um, family coat of arms would look like from your name and that. Find out what your name means. Now, actually, I've got a thing of that. I, I could probably do that, yeah. Yeah, I can agree with you there, Sling. So, 80s was definitely the best decade. <laughs> Although, I think people would uh, agree to differ, but depending on how old they are. Zed said, I switched, I watched that Alita film the other day. It's pretty good if you like action, sort of anime. Yeah, I remember you saying, Zed, yeah, I do want to watch that because I've got the original um, 
the original pilot manga for that. I want to watch that as well. What I was going to do, I was going to watch the original pilot manga, because that looks really good, and then I'll probably watch that. Yeah, I'll have a bit of that kind of stuff. Same for Ed. It's because I'm big on 80s nostalgia. When I said, thought you said Lolita, that's a different film. <laughs> I've never seen the Kubrick version. I've seen the other one. I can't remember it by. It's got um, Jeremy Irons. Let's not talk about that anymore, though. <laughs> but no, I've never seen it. I'll have to watch it one day, then. It is a comedy. I've always thought it might be a comedy, um, Kubrick one. D2 said 80s is un undoubtedly the best decade ever. <laughs> uh, now said, was the best, was the best to be around in, was the best to be around in Slingshot. Being said, I like 80s sci-fi and 80s music. I do, um, and I quite like, I quite enjoy a lot of 80s things. I like 80s films because they use 80s music and yeah. Well, no, Cubic one is dark comedy like Doctor Strange. All right, yeah. I'll check it out one day because the thing is, I want to watch all the Cubic films anyway, so I probably will get around to watching that one day. Gabriel said, favourite 80s film, got to be Back to the Future. That's a difficult one to, for me. There's loads of 80s films I really like. A lot of 80s horrors, I fucking, I love them. Yeah, absolute 80s, great channel. Yeah, The Thing, I suppose, yeah. There's loads of them. I like things like um, Maniac Cop. Yeah, the thing. Um, oh, I don't know. I, I could fucking probably read off loads of eighties films. Not see, so I'm more of an eighteen eighties man myself. <laughs> good for you. Big said nineties was the last good decade. Now it's all random shit, perhaps, and sequels. I think that was prequels and sequels and remakes of movies. Music is trash. Uh, the country is full of bungle trash around the corner of the earth. Yeah. <laughs> Let's not mention shit politics and snowflakes. Yeah, exactly. Oh, no, it's completely blocked. But no reason. I ain't got a cold or anything. It must just be a lot of dust in the air. I have got my fan on. Maybe it's doing that. Dan Volk, Predator. Yes. Now, there's a fucking film. Yeah. You right, Dan, by the way? Yeah, fucking hell. Yeah, Predator and the Alien films. Yeah, definitely agree with you there. Now I should have to stand on a stool to put, to put some jukeboxes on. But then said, I love the 1880s. I own quite a few things from the 1800s, from books and charts to weapons and tobacco boxes and spirit levels. That sounds good. I like, you know, a bit of history, isn't it? It's well worth owning. T2 said, I listen to 80s Liverpool Channel Radio in my car now. Fantastic. I love a bit of absolute, absolute 80s. Is good. Never never listened to that one, though. The Terminator, yeah, another fucking proper classic. There's a load of really good films from the 80s, aren't there? Lots of these are dust in the air, gas mask on now. <laughs> I need a new filter for I need a new filter first, though. What happened the stuff said? Watched... Dead Detectives the other day. If you like the Horde, Mike, I think you'll like it. About a fake, most haunted show that starts getting killed by a real haunted house. Not as good as the Horde, but still worth watching. I'll write that one down. The Horde was fucking great, wasn't it? It was one of those, I went into it with no expectations at all, and it was just good, wasn't it? I, I, I really enjoyed the Horde. It's one of those, keep it simple, keep it funny, good, good bit of toilet humour. Um, yeah. So said they don't make good movies anymore. I like synth wave music. Right, what was I going to write? Um, Dead Detectives then. I've got to turn the fucking page. Um, I said, yeah, I've really watched the Horde a couple of times. But I think the reason it's so funny is how closely it parodies so many of those shitty US reality TV shows. Yeah, that's probably what it is. Yeah. It's, a, it's really well done. I really enjoyed the Horde. The Horde, if anyone wonders, is a... What would you describe it as? Comedy, horror, mockumentary of um, paranormal... You know, like most haunted type things going around, but combined with um, 
the horde as in hoarders so they're going around haunted hoarders houses yeah it's 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 good it's um it's not a well-known thing you're combining ghost hunting and hoarder programs so yeah imagine ghost hunting programs and hoarder programs made into one film yeah extremely haunted hoarders it's fucking great it's really there's it's proper comedy um but yeah there's some proper laugh out loud bits in it well there's sort of ghosts in the hoarders houses <laughs> Not see that it's good, okay, mate. <laughs> well, you know me, I don't like to say too much, otherwise, I'll end up telling the whole fucking plot and spoiling it all. But if if I say it's good and it's well worth watching, <laughs> well, you know, I'm pitching a magical shop full of genie lamps and a chest full of cursed items. No, imagine Mr. Trebus's house being haunted. <laughs> Yeah, old Mr. Trebus from um, what was that fucking program? Life of Grime. The old man who um house was completely full of shit. Imagine that. <laughs> Bing said, "What so?" Bing said, "So what they do is go to antique shops and take stuff from dead people in hopes it gets haunted." No, no, no. Go around. They go around his these houses to clean them out, and they're they're haunted. So he said, "Yeah, oh, the Conan movies are great." You know I like that. I fucking love Conan Barbarian. Yeah, Predator. That will come up on the um, film club one day, definitely. Yeah. Predator is a fucking excellent film. Perhaps I'll base the synopsis on for people. Yeah, go on. Back as much on as you can. The yeah, Predator is excellent, isn't it, London? Oh, I love it. That's partly what um, got my brother interested in um, traps and that. Rambo and Predator. When did Predator come out? 1989? Something like that? 1986? Oh, The Keep, Irishman. Yeah, that's that's really good. I like that. I, I, that might come up in the um, film club one day. Well, I won't read out the synopsis, but you lot can read that. Yeah, uh, yeah London in here. <laughs> That's your psychic uh, abilities coming out again. Being said, I watch The Predator loads every year. Yeah, fucking, it's, it's, I love The Predator. I think it's an amazing film. <laughs> See, I am psychic. I know you'd say Rambo. <laughs> well, well, Bing, uh, fa I fa he favours Predator over alien films, though. Um, oh, fucking kickboxer, yes. Kickboxer, and I'll tell you the other one I always liked with Jean Claude Van Damme. Um, Cyborg. I always liked Cyborg with his, with his weird triple barreled gun. Now, JCVD is good enough. Um, Bing, as far as the Predator films go, I, Predator, Predator's the best one. But I do like Alien 1 and 2. I like, yeah. The thing with the Predator, some of the Predator films, like Predator 2, I didn't really like at all. Gabe Yo, it's a brilliant film. <clears throat> I'm Dinium said I'm not typing his long <laughs> his name, screw his parents. <laughs> Being said, the, JVC, the JCVD film is where he sets up and goes to prison is good. That one I've not seen. There's quite a few I've not seen, like the newer ones. There, are, there is actually a film called JCVD as well out there, where he's playing himself, I think. It was after he stopped doing films for a while. It does sound like a video player, don't it, Liam? Yeah, Legionnaire, I think I've seen most of that. Bloodsport, yes, very good. Universal Soldier, yes, very good. Yeah. yeah I thought, yeah, the first Alien vs. Predator, that, that wasn't bad, actually. You're right there, um, Dad. Like, they're not bad films. The others aren't bad, but um, I don't think they're as good. The best of all of them are Predator, Alien, and Aliens. That's they're the best out of all of them. Leo oh, had a good run. That was you having a run, wasn't it? Which one was Rec Room? Was that the newest one? I don't actually own any um 
John Claude Van Damme films, though, I don't think. I never got around buying them. The only martial arts films I own is a uh, Bruce Lee box set. I do like a bit of Bruce Lee. <laughs> well, enough, there's a really funny rip off of Predator called Robo War. Oh, fuck's sake. Yeah, that sounds <laughs> shit, but funny. The dude PX, right, mate? Good to see you on. Uh, John Claude Van Damme Johnson <laughs> on Amazon was funny. It's J C V D playing. Of oh, that, maybe maybe that's it then. I'm dealing for kickboxer is the reason I busted my shins open <laughs> kicking a tree down. Fuck's sake! <laughs> I wouldn't have tried that. Things I said. The one thing I like about the eighties is it's full of machismo. Irishman said nine deaths of injury. I think I've seen that. Yeah, Universal Soldier was good. Nadine said, I'm a martial art movie geek. I've watched so many of them. Yeah, I, I've, I do like martial arts, but I've not seen loads, I'll be honest with you. I've probably only seen more of the famous kind of ones. Nadine said, that was the reason I nearly disabled myself trying to do the, the split thing. Fuck's sake, Jim. Yeah, it both now so that sounds painful, London. They both sound bloody painful. That, that, yeah, London, so that movie does inspire you to train, like Rocky IV. Have you seen Twin Warriors with Jet Li? No, I don't think I have. I've not seen a lot of Jet Li films. I've seen some, but not many. <laughs> London, so same over here, 100 different martial arts films. I love them. That's the one with his fave. That's one of my favourites in Fist of Legend. Well, I have seen some Jet Li films, but not many. You know, Jackie Chan ones, some of the old Jackie Chan, proper old Jackie Chan stuff. But I don't own a lot of uh, martial arts stuff. Yeah, being said, motivational films, kickboxer and the Rocky film. Hawk the Slayer, I'm an uh, Irishman. Thank you for writing that. I've actually been trying to fucking remember that. If I'd have remembered, Hawk the Slayer would have been the next film club fucking film. But I couldn't fucking, um, I couldn't think of it. That's the one that Richard's always going on about. I think that's the one anyway. And is that the one that Rich mentions with the crossbows in? <laughs> Delta Force, is that um, Chuck Norris? I think I may have seen that. Oh, I think, who remembers the, uh, the action films with um, Hulk Hogan in? The dude PX said, Conan the Barbarian and Destroyer, to a lesser extent, are awesome. Hell, I, I even liked Red Sonja. I actually liked all of them as well. I think Zed, Zed don't like um, Red Sonja at all. I think it's Zed. Now said, I was a little punk in the 80s, slingshot. Got thrown out of school even. Zed said to Londinian, Mafia versus Ninja. Now there's a classic. <clears throat> yeah, Hawk the Slayer. I've been fucking trying to remember that and I couldn't remember it. Right, I'll stay on for a bit longer than normal. I might do quarter past. My throat's getting a bit better now. When I'm to Conan destroys a guilty pleasure of mine. Oh, Hercules in New York. Fucking hell, yeah. That is a great film. One of Arnold Schwarzenegger's first films, wasn't it? Maybe his first. They even dubbed his voice, didn't they? Yes, yeah, fucking... If, if you haven't seen Hercules in New York, that's a must-see. Urban Combat Boots, right, mate? Good to see you on. And you got a hoodie today, did you? Nice one. I need to get one my fucking self. What design did you get? That one or that one? Cheers, by the way, Urban. I appreciate that. Things like, yeah, I used to get into fights and family foods in the late 80s. That was a naughty old Urban. Yeah, I'm only going to be on for about 15 more minutes. And these are my favourite martial arts movers, probably Fist of Legend, On Back, Twin Warriors, Kickbox and Fearless. Maybe I said I was a little one in the 80s, born in 1987. Oh, yeah, oh, so you only just caught the 80s then, yeah. Okay, I'm all suited up. I've got to pop to the shops. Yeah, see you in a bit. I might still be on. I should, you should catch me for the last 10 minutes, Londonian. Or, yeah, maybe it's Beastmaster. Is that, is that what one of those involves um, crossbows? But Rich quite often mentions both of those.
Urban Combat Boots said, the one you have on. I'll do a video wearing it at some point. Nice one, mate. I appreciate that. Yeah, the hitter, that's good. Yeah. Um, Rocker House just died as well, didn't he? <clears throat> Maybe I said, on back. It's amazing. The guy that stars in it, so fluid and fast. Bing said, I wasn't even in that sack in the 80s. Now said, I got done for GBH twice, saying shot. I only defended myself there. Oh. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Being too born in the 90s. Missed out on the 80s then. <laughs> That's a love, Jackie Chan. Yeah, what's them police police ones? Um, the police. What's them? What are them ones? Um, I can't watch what's going now. Police Summer. Not Police Academy. Don't say that. When I said Hordes only has um, 4.4 on IMB. What idiots rate those ones? It should be much higher than that, shouldn't it? Didn't see one review saying it's not scary enough. <laughs> that's like say. Fucking dipshits, aren't they? Police story, that's it. Jim, cheers, mate. Yeah, what's a few of them? Deep, the deed, the, the dude PX. Have you ever seen Blind Fury? Rock oh, has a blind summer. I've seen some of that. That's that's one of those I want to see. Being said, I can only dream what the 80s was like. <laughs> Plenty of films you can watch. Leo said, how many people are like me and just occasionally comment, but for the most part, just watch? I think there must be quite a few, because there's 17 people watching and definitely not that many typing, I don't think. Things like me and the little bros are the toughest kids on the block. Nell said, Chuck Norris. I like. I've only seen a couple of Chuck Norris films. I said, Hobo with a Shotgun is my favourite Rick Hart film. Dad said, I really enjoyed the 80s. Mind you, the 60s and 70s weren't too bad either. Not see? Yeah, see you later, mate. I'm going to be on until quarter past, possibly. I said, it depends what mood I'm in, whatever topics come up. Yeah, I must admit, because sometimes I sit and just watch yours, Liam, but I'm on for the whole thing. Yeah, no, actually, yeah, Liam, I do it actually saying that. Yeah, I do it on Liam's. I quite often, I've, and I'll, you know, I'll pop in, but I watch the whole things, but yeah. And sit there watching it like this as well. Not doing anything else. Um, occasionally I'll do my exercise, but if I need a bit of exercise. But yeah, no, it's funny saying that, you know, I do it myself. Being said, I'm off. Night, guys and girls. Are you doing another video tomorrow? Yeah, I'll be on for that. I'll be on tomorrow, being 9 till 11 again. So see you later, mate. Good night. <laughs> When I said, if it's like if food keeps being bought up, I sort of phase out. Don't you look, you just you just bought it up five past eleven. Don't do it. <laughs> they like me. Think so. Yes, we found ourselves in tight situations. Now, so I'm thinking of getting a hoodie. To myself, um, with what you've got on now. Oh, nice one now, that one. I need to get a hoodie myself. I want one, <laughs> I can't afford it. You got to ask to buy me own fucking merchandise. I'm not reading out your comments, Ed. I refuse to do it. Might even delete it. <laughs> Irishman said, I remember the. The mid to late eighties, martial arts and then I'm all movies. Yeah, that's it. Funny, I said I said I'm going soon. The fucking things dropped down to thirteen. I ain't going yet. He still stay on for another ten minutes. I was I remember the mid eighties, mid to late eighties. I oh, know I read that didn't I? Good job I can't see what that emoji, that emoji is or whatever, Zed. I assume it's a sandwich or something. <laughs> um, so I might buy you a hoodie, lad. <laughs> well, I appreciate that. I'll get round to it one day, mate. I've got, I got the T-shirt and the uh, and the mug, at least. They're, they're the best thing for advertising. JBO said, have you seen No Retreat, No Surrender? Tell me a bit about that, because I think I have seen that. Dad said there was a lot of um, sci-fi as well. Fucking one neck is fucking aching, man. 
It's a green light. As I said, it comes up as just a square on mine. Slingshot said we were considered pretty boys. Uh, and when we proved ourselves, we, we were considered neighbourhood terrors. Nice. It's things like that, Slingshot, that make you the people you are, isn't it? So, yeah. <laughs> So what's everyone at tomorrow? If uh, don't forget to watch my um shooting competition video if you're joining in that. And anyone can join in. Urban Combat Boots, don't forget to watch it. Instructions. Bob just said, Did you hear about my nightmare last night, Mike? Was proper weird. No, I just I had a proper strange dream this morning that I was back in school. But it was uh, uh it was so weird. In the in my dream you was allowed to say stay in school for as long as you wanted. So there was literally people staying in school for 30 years, <laughs> 30, 40 years. You know, you could just stay every year. You could just stay. So in this school, there was, you know, 40 year olds, 50 year olds. Um, and I'd happened to stay on as well at my age and I was walking to school, but it turned out, I, um, it, this wasn't embarrassing though. Right. I was walking to school with just a towel on, and my ass was showing. Like where the towel came along, there was a hole. But I was, but I wasn't embarrassed in it. I was just, I just held it shut a bit, and then just carried on. And then I woke up. Debo said, "Jean Claude Van Damme plays Ivan, the bad guy, Russian, uh, and the boss guy who keeps bringing up the dojos, and the ghost of Bruce Lee trains a hero." I don't think I have seen that one. Although I have seen the one with. JVC's not always a baddie, is he? He's normally the hero, isn't he? Is it, is it one of his really old ones? Urban said he'll watch after this. Liam said, I wanted to go into a restaurant pub. I had to use the back door. Then I had to fight waves of bouncers to get in. Really bizarre. That is weird. Their profit, dreams are very bizarre, aren't they? I was with Yes said, Space Hunt has eventually been zone. It's worth a watch. I mentioned it a couple of weeks ago. Things such as, um, I had a few of those high school dreams. Yes, um, school dreams are weird, aren't they? I quite often have dreams about being back in school or in prison. Uh, and also, I used to smoke in my um, dreams still, even when I um, didn't in real life. Tim said he's magnet fishing tomorrow. Did a bit today. Got a pen knife, spade, motorbike frame. Uh, that's all right, isn't it? Um, and so I said, then there was a second bit I can't really remember about taking a bus home that kept randomly stopping. Strange, isn't it? Daryl, you're right, Daryl. Don't be telling their jokes. Uh, you know, I have a dream about being at school as an adult with other adults at least once a month. That's proper strange, isn't it? Proper strange. JBO said, Davis's first role, apparently. Uh, to be honest, it's a terrible film. That is the one I've I have seen some of that then, yeah. And he's wearing a black shirt and got the slick black hair. When I said, and when you smoked, did your hands exist? Because remember, I was told you can't have hands in streams. <laughs> Far as I remember, yeah, they, they existed all right. I think I had a dream where I was um in a sword versus machete fight. Dead to the Irishman, the one that was the sci-fi remake of the Magnificent Seven, can't remember the name of it. That sounds interesting. Now said, Tim, I like watching magnet fishing. There's a guy by me that does it. I must admit, not having the slow mode tonight has been bearable. It ain't been terrible. I don't know if we've had the normal amount on, though. Well, a bit of fucking, you know, um, where your wisdom teeth are, and you get that slump, a little bit of overhanging, um, gum sort of thing inside your mouth I fucking irritated it dad said it had robert vaughan reprising his role in the western sounds interesting you know sci-fi western that's two good fucking genres tim said to now you never know what you'll find just waiting for the great hall of guns and safes that's it <laughs> J 
Daryl, did I say to you, or did you hear about my um, gout coming back ever so slightly? If you're still on. But it, it, it only came on a little bit. I might get some fucking um, uric acid testers soon to see. Um, just so I can test it. That bastard, because it's made me not want to drink again for a while, just in case. <laughs> It's gold magnetic. <laughs> yeah, it's a fucking bastard. Down. Only a little. It came back a little bit. Uh, it was when I was looking after Matt's dogs, um, I have read some things that extreme weather changes and stress and back in your toe can bring it back on. Well, I did all three of them and a couple of the other trigger things. I was eating weird stuff as well. And it came back ever so slightly. I could feel it happening. So I... Um, I did nearly all of the remedies I could find. I ate some cherries. I did. I took some fucking turmeric, apple cider vinegar, and within the next day it was gone. But it's made me paranoid about drinking now. Um, so I'm going to buy some uric acid testers and just piss on them, and at least I'll know for sure then. You know, if I do that for a couple of days and I know there's nothing in it, then I probably could drink. But yeah, I don't, it can't be my diet though, because, you know, I've lost weight. I, eat, I don't eat any of the shit that brings it on, or not a lot of it anyway. Yeah, but luckily it was so mild that it never turned into full on gout. It, I didn't get the, I could feel it happening, but it didn't turn into the, you know, red bulging, you know, so painful, even the light shirt, that uh, sheet hurts, luckily. Unfortunately, gold isn't magnetic. Ned said, "Beyond Battle Beyond the Stars, it's called. Nice. Now said, once I, was, once I was watching, while I was watching, found a gun, so he rang the police, so they sorted it. They found another one, so the police came back about five times to come out for his fines. Actually, that's the only thing with the guns. You probably won't get nothing for them because you just have to fucking, if you're doing it all legally, you've got to give it to the police, haven't you? And also, would you want to keep a gun that was found in a river? I mean, because you don't know what fucking um, was that what that's been doing. Thanks, so What do you know about English folklore? Depends. You'd have to ask me. Like specific things. Now saying that down, down said hello now. Um, as I've said, be legally be the code word. <laughs> yeah, open a museum of murder weapon. That's it. Oh, Cobra. I forget about Cobra. Yeah, that was excellent. That was, wasn't it? I'll oh, see you later, Jim. Sorry, mate. Good night. Yeah, I'm going to be off any minute now. I've done two hours, 15 minutes. Yeah, I've seen... I think... Um, Bushcrafting found something like that. I don't really know nothing about English fairy folklore. Um, slingshot. Fourth protocol, I don't think I've seen. Cobra the film with pig, pig, pig. Now, so I think we all managed okay. Maybe because the high man sleeping, I reckon. I reckon. Although, that's been still quite a weird conversation tonight, hasn't it? Even without his strange input. <laughs> Kenny said, I think I heard folklore. You can kill a Frenchman with a bow. Yeah, I've heard that. On a Wednesday on a certain day of the year. All right, what's time? 23.15. Tell you what, I've rounded it off. I'll go to, I've got 40, you've got 42 seconds left. Here's the um, Twitch again, because some of you have actually joined. But yeah, it's piss easy. There's no fucking around on Twitch. Once you go to that page, that's it. You don't need to search for videos. The chat's there and the video's there. Yeah, see you later, Kenny. 
So yeah, but join that. Then then four days a week, I'll talk to you on there. And eventually, when I save up the money, I'll buy a fucking camera. You're only going to see it about that big, but you know, at least I can swear at you then. <laughs> I'll give you, I'll give you a thumbs up in a tiny little screen. Thank you, Tim. Well, th well, the only thing is, that, yeah, in theory it could, but they only let you use the official Sony ones. Yeah, yeah. You, you can't use anything. They have a special fucking, um, you know, lead on them that you don't get on any fucking thing else. Now say yes, twitch that away. <laughs> Urban said, I thought it was a Welshman. I, I, it may be that. I did I did in my head think it might have been that. Urban, I do Twitch pretty much Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, 10 till 12. Dad has saying, sorry, I can't help myself. You mean like Quentin Crisp? I don't know if he'd know Quentin, Quentin Crisp is, would he? You'd have to think of... Um, can't think of anyone. <laughs> All right, I ain't going to get involved in this one anyway. <laughs> right. I'll see you all tomorrow. Thank you all for watching. It's been a fucking decent stream tonight. I enjoyed that. Um, I'll see some of you on Twitch soon, Monday. I don't do Sundays. I like to have at least one night off. Um, you know, unless I'm playing. The, yeah, Freddie Mercury, that's about That he would know, Zed, yes. <laughs> right. I'll see you all tomorrow. Um, what, 9 to 11 then yeah I forget the only fucking times yeah thank you for watching everyone that's been a proper decent stream I enjoyed that they've been good they've been good for ages actually um, yeah I ain't gonna jinx it because uh, I, I just you know as long as I told people what the fucking score was that, that helped I think so yeah but no they've been decent so see you tomorrow good night thank you for watching everyone I appreciate it <laughs>